Sheila Mwigama and I'm based in New York City. Before Bookmore TV, definitely that was my mindset. My mindset was very bad. Like I will get audition and right away I'll be like, I'm not good enough. They're not gonna like me. I have an accent. And then from then, it'll be just a mess. Going into the self-tape audition, I'll just get on my head and the audition right there will be trash. And then I'll leave you feeling crap. Like, why would I let that moment do that to me? But then I realized my mindset was not right. So I, when I joined Bookmore TV, and that's the first thing that Christine starts with her, her course is the mindset. The mindset is the most important thing because you are what you say you are. And I know she said something like this, everything you say is a prayer. So if you say you're not good enough, then you're not gonna be good enough. If you say you're not good for the character, then you bring in that energy into the character and telling the casting director like, I'm not good for this character. So you have to change your mind. Everything starts with the mind. And it takes a while, it just doesn't happen overnight, but you just have to practice it every day. And get excited when you get that C mail and you know, it'll be all right. Christine's help tapes, that part was my favorite part because like I said, self tapes that used to cripple me, like I used to get scared. And when I look at her, the tapes that she self-taped and then how they look like on set, I was like, damn, like this, this is possible. Like you just have to have the confidence and you have to do the work. So when I saw her self-tapes, I was like, there is nothing to fear. You just have to believe in yourself, get to work. Cause she is fierce. Each and every audition that she was doing, she was fierce, honey, she owned it. And then you look at the, the what was on TV, and you realize you haven't been doing anything with your life. So that was like my aha moment with the self tape. So I'm, I'm thankful for that. I keep rewinding, I keep watching it all the time. <laughs> to believe in myself, that, that right there, because I never used to believe in myself, just to be free and also to play with my hair. Like I used to be box myself like, okay, I'm like this thing with a natural hair. This is how they're supposed to look at me. And Christine's like, girl, you, 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 you suppose they, you supposed to train them how, you know, you should show them what you should be. You know, they shouldn't be the one who should tell you how, what you should be like, be yourself. And then they'll get that. So right now I'm so free with my auditions. I just taken my new headshots and, um, with my natural hair, with this hair and the long hair. And I feel so good. I feel like crying right now because I used to box myself so much because I'm thinking I'm supposed to be seen this way. She's African. This is how it's supposed to be. And I didn't realize maybe that's why I wasn't even booking anything. But now with that, for me personally, I am free. I'm no longer going to apologize. This is who I am and they're going to take me as I am, period. <laughs> How I will uh, describe Christine's coaching style is she is no, like she doesn't play. Like she is serious about her thing. Okay. Okay. And I'm not saying this just to scare you because at the end of the day, we want to be babysit and, not, and, and this is not what the business is about. She is real. She is honest. She is dedicated. She loves what she does because I've been doing so many, I've been hopping left and right on this exit. I mean, COVID, some people are just there for the point, but she's there because she wants you to win. For me, I don't want to be associated with anybody who doesn't want nobody to win. She wants you to win, but it's not easy. You have to put in the work. Okay, just because she has this course and it's, it's great, then you can just realize like, okay, no, you have to put in the work. Do the work, do something for yourself, okay? If you are, don't worry about the money, okay? There was a point I was hesitant, like, no money, I don't have money, like, but I'm like, okay, you don't have the money, but do you have the career you want, sis? Because clearly you need help, right? I'm so glad, Christine, that I took this course. And if you doubting, please don't doubt, get on it and trust me and give yourself a chance, okay? I'm just saying, I did, and I'm going further. And soon I'll be putting it on my Instagram, hashtagging Kristen and be like, girl, book day, because I'm a booking magnet. <laughs> I'm a booking magnet. It's an investment. It's an investment for yourself. If you, if you are serious about this, okay? Because we sit at home, we're waiting for the calls to come in, we want to book, but we're not putting in the work. You know what I'm saying? People are out there hustling. You're not the only one. People are hustling. You're sitting at home and you're worried about the money, 
But then I'm and I'm I'm not. We all work hard for our money. I'm not telling you, hey, don't buy Starbucks, don't go drink it. But I'm just saying you have to think about what you want in life. Invest on yourself. This course will change your life. So you better get your life.